What's up guys, how you guys doing today? I hope that wasn't too delayed. But um today my topic is gonna be getting friend zone. As you can see from the title below. Yesterday I'm sorry I didn't have much to talk about and it seems like in every in every time I start the vlog I sound so stupid and also I don't have anything to talk about. Well, I do now, but like yesterday I didn't have shit to say. And that's not normal for me, but it's it's when you get wrapped up in stuff one time you might you might not even you might not even have anything to talk about in your vlog and that's the thing about vloggers we have to come up with um we have to come up with a bunch of stuff to talk about to entertain you guys so so let's get to this okay now um I don't really like expressing myself too much, but I'll tell you guys anyway. I mean, it's not like a lot of people actually watch my vlogs, right? And again, this is going to be a short vlog. I'm going to try to keep each and every one of my vlogs short. I mean, I know I have goals to get past 25 minutes or so, but until I start getting traffic, um, actually doing... Um, I'm not going to really be doing any of the long vlogs. My vlog should be the longest I'll probably ever do if, if, if it, it's if I have a lot to say or I have, like, something happened and I have to tell you guys about it. But this is what happened. Last night, um, I was bored, okay? After I was done vlogging... You guys can see I was obviously really bored. I had nothing to do. So, I walked my ass downtown over here to the club because I was bored. I didn't have nothing to do. I just wanted to get trashed and then fall asleep. Well, obviously, that, that, that kind of worked and it kind of didn't because I called some of my friends up and... I had too many. I had way too many. And <laughs> you know what happens when you have way too many. So, um, this goes from my older uh, viewers. So, yeah. <laughs> but, um, yeah. So, I'm in the club. Or well, we're in the club. We're having fun. I have my friends over. We're, we're talking. We're laughing. We're dancing. We're making jokes. Uh, some people even... Wanted to go and put stuff on other people's car and vandalize it, which um, I didn't want to get into. So I let them, I let them bounce out of the club, and um, I stayed with my other friends, and we did a lot of fun and freaky shit. Um, I don't mean like freaky, freaky, because right now I'm on a girl thing, and I don't want to. Yeah, <laughs> I don't, I don't want to get into all of that. So here's what went down: me and my friends. We were, we were sitting down, and after we were dancing and stuff, we went to go, we went back to go sit down, and I, I get back up because I'm obviously, you know, I don't even know what happened. I get back up from the things that I do remember is, I get back up and I go to dance with my other friends, and they went to go sit down. The girls went to go sit back right down, and one of the boys were still like on the floor, dance floor, and I went to go dance with him. And so I kind of don't like the fact that this actually happened because, like I said, my boyfriend wouldn't approve of it, and I can get in serious trouble, but I kind of told him. But, babe, let me tell you now I know you watch my logs every day. So, let me tell you about what happened last night. So, we were dancing for a while, and I get closer, he gets closer, and he he kind of, I thought he was trying to kiss me, so, because he had his hand right there, but it was part of his dancing routine, so, I lean in, and he instantly hits the reject button, and it's okay, it's okay, because usually when you're, Usually when you're hammered, you don't know what the fuck you're doing. So, I lean in. I try to, you know, kiss him and everything. I didn't know that he didn't want to, so. But he was cool about it afterwards and stuff. But, friend zone, me, like, you should always, 
you should always consider yourself in the friend zone with any relationship you have unless you're actually dating somebody because being in the friend zone can benefit you and that person that you're in the friend zone with so what I'm trying to say is that it's okay to be in the friend zone you can have your space you don't have to worry about someone interacting with you uh, inappropriately or anything like that you can have a normal conversation a normal meet uh, you can joke about random shit and don't have to worry about um, staying quiet the whole time you'll actually have something to say um yeah you have you have a bunch of freaky shit to talk about and you'll have more things to do with the person so and then if it, if if, if, it, uh, if I can't even speak if anything ex escalates that's good too because you know you can get into um going out more by yourself one on one or maybe he might invite his friends or something like that but yeah try to try to stay in the friend zone with this this uh your crush or your friend just yeah just try to stay in the friend zone for a while and then after a while if you know you guys do start escalating and it's okay this um st it, they give you the okay to you know and touch them i'm not talking about there or here it's it's not like that i mean like just you can like give a little handshake maybe, maybe a little punch on the arm just, just something friendly and when they give you the uh okay to like um touch them and stuff i mean that's actually escalating into like uh best friends or or something like that i mean you want to start you don't want to push too far but you want to start pushing toward getting into a relationship whatever i don't know i'm not making that much sense but <laughs> it's just if you guys do understand please please like that blah, blah, blah. Just thumbs up, Nico. Also, um, go check out my fr my friends. They they have millions of subscribers. They're funny as shit. So yeah, go check them out. And I, I mean, I know a lot of you guys know, a lot of you guys don't. But I don't know. I'm gonna advertise them anyway. Um, if I could put it here, I would. I will be editing tomorrow, no matter what. Um, I'll figure out how to put the words up here somehow. But yeah, I will try to put their link up here. But um, if it is here, uh, go or just go down in the description. The link will be there for sure. Um, it's Onage Pranks. Go check them out. They're really funny. They have you laughing. They won't have you clicking off their page. I mean, they're they're amazing. Shout out to you, Russell. Um, they do a lot of good stuff. I mean, like they're funny. They if you're having a glum day, just watch a bunch of their pranks. They they have new merch out. I'll try to find a link to their merchandise, and I'll put it below. Also, I'll have a shitload of um, links below. And, yeah, go check them out. They have real pretty good merch. They have beanies to sweatshirts to shirts to hats to gloves and all kinds of stuff in there. They're also putting more merch out, so go check them out. Uh, go check out their videos, go subscribe, go like, go go smash that uh, like button up. Oh, looks like a ball spot right there. Um, yeah, I hope I help, helped you a little bit, but like I said, it's okay to be friend zone. It's where you want to be for now. And then if you guys can escalate, go ahead. Try it, push it, go for it. And if you're feeling real confident, then ask that person to be with you. But, and that's only if you know that they kind of like you or they really like you and they haven't said anything. But yeah, go check them out, follow my advice, subscribe, like, comment, and subscribe if you're new. Like I said before, I have a bunch of giveaways. I can enter your names, just comment below on what you want and comment below on, um, just comment below. Yeah, just what you want. And your name should be there already. Subscribe and go check out a bunch of uh, merchandise from Only Pranks. Also, go check out a bunch of merchandise from Lance. Uh, a lot of you Lancers know. Um, I'm going to call you guys Lancers because I don't really know what you guys are called yet because he hasn't announced anything. So, yeah, go check out his merch. Go check out his page. I'm also working on some merch. It should be up there. Next week, I will give you the link to the description. Um, 
also I do have a store out but um for some reason I'm still trying to push more merch I mean it's enough for you guys to say oh I want that because it's cool and stuff like that but um I'm also just trying to get more merch out so a, a lot of merch also I'm gonna be putting my um fan mail thing back down there so you guys can send fan mail I'll open it I'll send you something back that's how it goes um yeah so I hope you guys did enjoy this uh, video if you did make sure to smash that thumbs up I really appreciate it don't forget to check out Onage pranks um, and they're really funny I hope you guys did enjoy do enjoy them they're really they're funny there's something that somebody would actually want to watch but if you did enjoy this video make sure to smash that thumbs up I really appreciate it don't forget to turn on my post notifications so you never miss a new video and I will see you videos later